Welcome back to Top 10 Magazine. My name is Tom, and in this video, we'll shine a spotlight on the lives and actions of 10 infamous female criminals. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more Top 10 videos like this one. Number 1. Bonnie Parker. Born in Rowena, Texas in 1910, Bonnie Elizabeth Parker met Clyde Chestnut Barrow in 1930 and they began a 21-month crime spree robbing banks, gas stations, and stores across five Midwestern states. Though she never fired shots herself, she was an willing accomplice, helping plan each robbery, acting as lookout, loading guns, and kidnapping bank workers. The duo evaded capture through multiple shootouts, killing at least 13 people including nine police officers. Their exploits gained nationwide fame during the Great Depression. They died in a police ambush in Bienville Parish, Louisiana, in 1934. Number 2. Griselda Blanco. Known as La Madrina, the Black Widow, and the Cocaine Godmother, Griselda Blanco pioneered cocaine trafficking from Colombia to Miami, Florida establishing routes used for decades after. At her peak in the 1970s, 80s, she was one of the richest and most powerful drug lords, commanding an empire valued at over $2 billion. Blanco maintained her power through ruthless violence, ordering the deaths of between 150 to 250 people, inventing motorcycle ride-by killings. She evaded prosecution for decades before being deported to Colombia where she lived in hiding until being assassinated in 2012, shot twice in the head by a motorcyclist in Medellin at age 69. Number 3. Ulrika Mainhoff. Born Jutta Marie Mainhoff in 1934 in Oldenburg, Germany. Mainhoff directly participated in bank robberies, car bombings, kidnappings, and assassinations during the 1970s and early 1980s. Most notoriously, the group kidnapped Hans Martin Schleyer, an industrialist and former SS officer, and organized the hijacking of Lufthansa Flight 181. Mainhoff was arrested in 1972 after a two-year intense manhunt when she was found hiding in a Berlin apartment. She was sentenced to eight years in prison for assault, attempted murder, and forming a criminal organization. She was found hanged in her cell in Stamheim Prison in Stuttgart in May 1976 at age 42. The circumstances of her death are disputed, either suicide or murder. Number 4. Fulan Devi. Born into the Mala, Boatman, cast in rural Uttar Pradesh, India in 1963, Fulan Devi was married at 11 to an abusive man three times her age. She escaped, became involved in banditry, and joined a gang that targeted high caste families. After the gang leader killed her lover, she massacred 22 upper caste Thakra men in Baymai village in 1981 to avenge his death. Devi led her gang across central and northern India for two years, committing over 30 kidnappings and robberies before surrendering in 1983. She was controversially elected to parliament in 1996 as a champion for lower castes before being shot dead by masked assassins in Delhi in 2001 at age 37. Number 5. Myra Hindley. Born in Crumpsall, Manchester, England on July 23, 1942, Myra Hindley began a relationship as a teenager with Ian Brady and participated in the abduction, sexual assault, torture, and murder of five children ranging from 10 to 17 years old between July 1963 to October 1965. The victims were Pauline Reed, John Kilbride, Keith Bennett, Leslie and Downey and Edward Evans. The brutal killings became known as the Moore's murders. Along with Ian Brady, Hindley was eventually found guilty of three murders and sentenced to life imprisonment, which was a rare sentence for a woman at the time. She passed away still incarcerated on November 15, 2002 after decades of failed appeals for parole, at age 60. She became Britain's longest-serving female prisoner. Don't forget to like and share this video if you enjoyed it, and subscribe to our channel for more top 10 videos like this one. Number 6. Ma Barker. Born Arizona Donnie Clark on October 8, 1874 in Ash Grove, Missouri, she later became famous as the leader of the Barker Carpus criminal gang which included her four sons. The gang committed murder, robbery, and kidnapping across much of the Midwestern and Southwestern United States during the early 1930s, traveling frequently to avoid capture. Ma Barker has been portrayed and sensationalized as the gang's criminal mastermind who strategized and organized their crimes, however her true role remains debated. 
She died aged 61 on January 16, 1935 during a dramatic four-hour violent shootout with FBI agents led by Melvin Purvis in Lake Weir, Florida that also killed her son Fred. Number 7. Belle Gunness. Born Brynhild Storset on November 11, 1859 near Selbu, Norway. In 1881 she immigrated to the United States, moving to the city of Chicago. Later relocating to Laport, Indiana, she ran a farm there where she murdered two daughters, several suitors, boyfriends, and potentially her two sisters, between 1884 and 1908, gaining notoriety as the Lady Bluebeard serial killer. Her motive was believed to be profiting from life insurance payouts on the dead. The number of murders she actually committed is unknown but estimated between 25 to 40 people. Gunness disappeared after her farmhouse burned to the ground on April 28, 1908, coincidentally just as investigators began probing the suspicious disappearances related to her. Number 8. Rosemary West. Born Rosemary Pauline Letts on November 29, 1953 in Muchmarkle, Herefordshire, England, Rosemary West, together with her husband Fred West, raped, tortured and murdered at least 12 young women and girls at their home on Cromwell Street in Gloucester, often brutally mutilating their bodies. The murders occurred between 1973 to 1987 when the couple were finally arrested. An active and willing participant in the murders, Rosemary sexually assaulted victims herself and participated in at least eight of the killings. Before she could be prosecuted, Fred West committed suicide while in custody. Rosemary West was convicted of 10 murders in 1995 and sentenced to life in prison where she remains incarcerated today at HMP Low Newton in Durham, aged 70. Number 9. Ilsa Koch. Born Ilsa Kohler on September 22, 1906 in Dresden, Germany, she married Carl Otto Koch in 1936 and became a guard at the Sachsenhausen concentration camp. As wife of the commandant at Buchenwald until 1941, she selected prisoners with interesting tattoos to be killed so their skin could be made into household lampshades and other items. Koch was arrested in 1943 on charges of embezzlement. After the war, U.S. authorities sentenced her to life in prison for war crimes. She was found dead by suicide in her cell in Achak Women's Prison in Bavaria on September 1, 1967. Number 10. Aileen Wernos. Born Aileen Carol Pittman on February 29, 1956 in Rochester, Michigan. Wernos had a turbulent childhood filled with abuse and turned to prostitution at a very young age. Between 1989 and 1990, she shot and killed seven men in Florida while working as a prostitute, claiming they either raped her or attempted to rape her. She was eventually arrested in 1991 and convicted of six of the murders, sentenced to death by execution. In the weeks before she was executed by lethal injection on October 9, 2002 at age 46, she admitted her claims of self-defense were untrue, dictated instead by her unstable mental state and rage. Want to see more top 10 videos like this one? Subscribe now and join our community.